Hey, Broke Black Man here, and I just received a message from my friend who was like, Broke, we gotta go see this movie. And I'm like, I don't have any money to go see a movie anytime soon. Unless we're planning on robbing a bank. And then she was like, no, 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 I'll pay for your ticket, Broke. Don't worry. I'm like, hey, if you're offering me a free movie ticket, let's go. So she says, this is the movie Split. And I'm like, Split what? She's like, no, the movie's just called Split. So I'm like, let me go look this thing up. And what happens? I find out a new trailer had just dropped for it. So let's see how Split is. All right, let's just react to it. Hey, pardon me, sir. I think you have the wrong car. Shoot! You've emailed for an appointment two days in a row. Tell me what's going on. I've never seen a case like this before. 23 identities live in Kevin's body. What? Did something happen? There's a flower on the pillows, a flower in the bathroom, like we're important. Who is that? Maybe she can help us. We're here! We're here! Don't worry. He knows what you're here for. He's not allowed to touch you. He knows that. <laughs> My name's Hedwig. I have red socks. How old are you? Nine. The human brain is the most complex object in the universe. The only way we're getting out of here is if one of them decides to let us out. Aren't you the clever one? Hedwig, could you help us? Okay. I have a window in my room. Maybe you could show us. Oh, that's here. Now it's closed. Now it's open. Did you think it was a real window? So you could leave? An individual with multiple personalities can change their body chemistry with their thoughts. What? Someone's coming for you. unlocks the potential of his brain. There is no limit to what he can become. The name is a sacred night. You will be in the presence of something greater. The world will understand that. The beast is real. The hell? Awful things to people, and he'll do awful things to you. Wow, just wow. It looks like James McAvoy is not gonna be no Jedi Obi Wan in this film. It looks like he is gonna be the big bad. He just on the highway, it appears that when whoever was driving the teenage girl's car, like he or she must have stepped out and went in. And James McAvoy just went in and just sprayed them with something. Who knows what it was. And then next thing you know, they're in some type of bunker or somewhere, uh, wherever they are. And he's like, oh. He's not going to touch you. You're mine now. But this time he's dressed as a woman. Then we just find out that, oh. He has, like, not one, but two, but 23 different personalities. Like, I never heard of that before. I don't know if it's possible. I mean, like, n nothing's really impossible. It's probably improbable, but, like, wow. Like, you may hear someone has either 1 to 10 or maybe 9 max, I think, was the last latest. But, like, that's, like, very interesting. Like, you you have like 23 different personalities like in man female then I remember one it was like a child I believe he was like nine years old and when one of the kidnapped girls was like uh, can you show me a window or something like show me your room so maybe she could like see a window and like escape he showed her a picture that he drew of a window the first picture was the window closed he flipped it over and another picture of the window was open he's like Open, close, open, close, open, close, open, close. I'm like, then he like looked at it like, oh, what? You thought you could escape? Like, was that the instant where the 
his personality had instantly changed. Like, you don't know what's going to trigger it, how it, it all happens. I'm not familiar with the disorder, but, like, oh my goodness, like, who knows? Like, will one of those personalities be the one that actually doesn't try to help the girls escape? Or all of them are in on this and just torturing these kidnapped girls? You know, they say, like, oh, they're leaving, he leaves me a flower on each pillow, like, He's preparing for something. And then we see another scene where they're giving reference to this beast. Like, is that a personality or actually there is a creature there? We don't know. I'm, I'm guessing it's a personality because there was points in time where you see he's like changing his body structure. And then the therapist or doctor was like, he would, with a split personality disorder or wherever the um, diagnosis really is called, like, can change their body structure by their thoughts, so who knows? So, this really seems like an interesting movie to actually go look at, and did the trailer tell too much? Not necessarily, because they didn't tell us, like, all the different types of personalities. They, don't, they didn't, like, tell us, like, is this taking, which, what's the chronological order of this? Because at one point, you see... James McAvoy's character visit the doctor. So, is this after it takes place or before it takes place? So, it's very interesting how this movie is going to coincide. So, hmm. This really seems interesting. I'm glad that my friend has like, told me about this. I really want to see this movie now. You know, I give this trailer a A minus B plus towards rating, you know. Because again, or I could just give it a C because this is an M. Night Shyamalan film. Because you don't know what's going to happen. It could end up being good. A bad twist at the end. Like he could hit us with another sixth sense here. Or who knows. It can just be a flop like that movie that I just don't want to name. That ruined my Nickelodeon childhood. But, hell, oh, that's just me being nostalgic. I really shouldn't blame the guy. He's a director. He sees whatever he wants in his eyes of how he saw that cartoon show. But, I'd like to hear your comments, so please leave it in the comment section down below. Please leave a like, and if you're new, please hit that description button and turn on those notification bell for future videos. My name is Broke Black Man 94 and I am... Signing off.